at it again with another day in the life and times of J.C. Rocket and his adventure. You know, maybe we'll see how his other friends are doing in the in their survival stories. But right now, we're gonna focus on J.C. for a good minute. Um, as we got in the inventory, man, I have my mouse on like high speed now, which I guess might be kind of good. We'll see. Um. Okay, so we got the large backpack last time, and I hauled my butt back to the safe zone. And literally, um, we were looking at how to stay safe and gather gear up on um, unofficial servers so that you don't have to really worry about getting killed because in um, Infestation, you have to remember it's not Warzy anymore, in Infestation, um, dang, it's like remembering the WWE is not the WWF, but forget about it. All right, so in infestation, um, people will kill you probably much more than zombies will because you can actually outrun zombies if you don't get cornered, basically. All right, so I'm going to go with a trusty bat. Um, the metal bat is better right here. Katana certainly is better. Actually, tactical knife. Take him down in three hits. Uh, 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 jig him in the forehead. But, um take the bat because we're actually I'm actually gonna go into an official server there's one joint that I actually want to see um, yeah official servers I'm in a safe zone now so I'm not really too worried too much but I might get popped on the way of going a few feet out and then looking at this area it's actually a barn that I want to go see and go to the 007 server and the barn is up north um, I have to look at the map to tell you what that, so that community is called or whatever. Alright, let's see how long it's going to take for the game to load up. Um, any other commentary? Um, if you like the videos and you want to see some more JC, Rocket, subscribe to the video channel. MGDFX represent I game too tv.com and we also do gamerculture.com and all that good stuff gamer culture has more news about just being a gamer and about the whole community feel and all that good stuff um, it's pretty good pretty fun um need more people to game with actually i'm always looking for friends this is actually why i started it to begin with this whole i game to scenario was to find peeps to the game with you know when oh almost there almost there come on you can do it ride it my pony oh my gosh you know what i mean i'm in cambodia now so it kind of takes a little bit longer to get in these servers hopefully when i'm not in go to the servers i'm not the dude from uzbekistan that's bringing the lag to the servers but hey if i don't lag you know, if I can do a jig, yeah, still got that block, man. All right, now, what's the name of this civilization? Just so I can get reference, because... All right, so this joint is called um, Blue Ridge Settlement. Sorry, <laughs> civilization. The Blue Ridge Settlement. Now, what I want to do is I want to check out... I don't even know if I can go in this barn. But I want to see if there's any goodies in this barn right here. There are nothing. There is nothing. There are nothing. What's that? Okay, there's nothing here. Now, the ideal thing to do would be, and this would be ideal in like War Z if it actually worked that way, would be to find a group, hit tab, look at all the people, you know, pick some peeps you want to, oh, this is the other thing. Pick the people that you actually want to become, a, you know, a group with and go around and go through adventures but it doesn't happen like that because everybody's really out for themselves unless they're playing with a friend now if you see some of these people like I'm a civilian new jack to the game don't really go around killing people yet and um <laughs> but you have other peeps and these peeps are called thugs thugs go around and murk your stuff 
what did they do? They usually don't spawn camp, but I heard they did at the beginning. But um, they basically hide in the shadows, wait for you to run past. Doof, doof, doof. You know what I mean? Two to the chest, one to the forehead. And then they just grab all your stuff, and you're left to wait for an hour. Or like me, I just go on in with another character. So, all right, let's start this adventure. And what do I want to do now? Um, Actually, I want to go to the same area. This is going to take a little while. Actually, well, I got a bat. So, hmm. All right, let's see what's going on. All right, let's just wander about, not aimlessly, of course. Let's go to a mission. We got lucky with a book bag. Let's see what luck we can find going to, um, I feel like a dude skipping in the woods, <laughs> but there's zombies among us. Um, see what other stuff we can actually gather. Always look for guns, you know what I mean? That, um, military blade is real good. I didn't know how good it was until I actually saw another vid and this dude was jigging it up. I was like, yo, three hits and they go down. It actually does. You, you get close to him and all that stuff. And you have to be able to switch to, um, first person view. Hit that C button. Boom! And then, you know, oh wait, where's the bat? Oh yeah. And now you're in first person view. <laughs> Alright, let me make sure I'm still going the same way. Okay, good. Um, but, you know, I'm not really... You know, my favorite game is Splinter Cell, so I'm not used to doing this whole... It just seems strange to me. Um, so I'm more used to, like, um, third-person view than I am first-person view. Probably if I'm, be, you know, gunning to be a thug or whatever, then I'll go to, like, um, first-person view more regularly. I wonder why they had this place like all open and stuff like that. Now, does anyone say anything? Dark Steel, where are you? Okay. And that's a global thing, so it's not like he didn't, <laughs> he either doesn't know how to group up or something like that. Sometimes this running, it feels like, tag on, it takes a long time, but you're kind of like excited to get to where you're going, so it's like, oh, oh. So, all right, we're going to stick, we're going to stay away from, you can't see my mouse, but um, we're not going to go to local mountain campsite, which you will get mapped there, but we'll go to Springer Ridge, Triangle Park, and then go to, um, what it, um, the cabin up north. Crystal Lake is like a dead zone. You go there, oh yeah, you are dead. Dead, 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 dead. Well, not really, but there's a lot of zombies there, so you just got to jig it up and beat them up and stuff like that. But what I've also found is you can actually just sneak past the zombies. So usually when you're on like a, a, a populated server, you really just have to make sure that um, you're looking out for the human beings. Like, right now, there's no looking over the shoulder, like, armor 2, like, a friend of mine. Oops. I'm <laughs> going the wrong way. Am I still going the right way? Okay. Like a friend of mine was saying when we both played, um, Infestation. Like, in, um, in DayZ, you can actually look behind you on your left shoulder and right shoulder. So, you can actually see if there's someone, like, stalking you here. You know, you're actually running and someone could be, like... <laughs> making their own videos just stalking peeps or whatever All right remember I have no guns check this inventory there are no guns all I got is mini saints always good for food and drink um, cup of soup instant oatmeal and a bag of chips chocolate bar man they got a whole lot of nothing sometimes you know what I mean Alright, to show you the power of Mini Saints, let's do it now and hit three. Mini Saints is number three. And just check out the bottom left, and you'll see the water and food go back alive. Mmm. 
food more than water, of course. I've actually never tasted many saints, so I don't know how they actually taste. But I know they're quite good for you in infestation. Now, it actually took me a while to buy this game because everybody was like, oh, it sucks. Yada, yada, yada. And when I went to, like, to look at live streams of it, um, it was always matched up with Daisy usually. So some days Daisy would have more. Some days they'd be tied. And some days Warzy would be more. So I really didn't know which one to get. But because, you know, um, I actually met somebody here at my bar at Pit Stop in Cambodia. And he was like, get Arma, get um, Daisy, because, you know, Warzy sucks. And um, I play Arma too, yada, yada, yada. So I got it. I actually never played with the dude. But, um,. They had this unbelievable sale where you could get War Z for like less than five dollars, and I was like, when it was called War Z, you know, <laughs> it's only called War Z like hmm, a week and a half after I bought it, and then it became called um, Infestation, which is kind of weird because when you think of Infestation, you think of cockroaches. Maybe just just me being from New York. All right, um, yeah, go on. Feel <laughs> feel like what's that game called? feel like I'm on, like, freaking EverQuest. And it takes a day, and you actually have to travel a whole day to get somewhere. Alright, so let's go. And then the other thing is, are you really where you want to be? Alright, so like I said before, best place to get... Oops, where am I going? Look at me. Headed the wrong way. Alright. Make sure, yep, yeah, almost there. Um, yeah, that black box thing is mad annoying. I hope they fix that soon. But I heard it only happens to certain graphic cards. And, you know, laptop didn't come with Nvidia. Still a good ass laptop. But I do need a new one. thing I do like is being able to like hear zombies coming. Like that's like stupid dumb scary. Alright. Um, but actually that breathing is not zombies, that is me. Or not me, that's JC Rocket. Alright, so here we come. And we're actually on the right side of the place today. But we all know it's the second house that gives you some goodies. If you don't have any already. So I'm going to head to that second house first. But I'm going to take a long way. Let me get this stamina up. Just in case I gotta run for it. Okay. Stuff is still there. Uh oh. I hate when this happens. <laughs> and this is like a punk buster thing or whatever like that. Yeah. Yeah, I saw the forums about that. I don't know.